Okay, just a quick update. My brother Paul's been here on his own today. I've been working at um, Corfe Castle, not on the castle, but in the village of Corfe Castle. So he's done well, hasn't he? You know, he's decked all that out. Quite a lot of work. And then it just started to absolutely cane it down with rain. So I think he's hoping to come at a mile. Well, not hoping, but he said he might do. And put a layer of felt on. So can you see the bubble? Hopefully you can see the run on it. It's got a nice run. Well, it's the existing roof. Look at it here, that holds water there. All through there, so he's gonna cut, I think he's gonna cut this back and then start felting from there on, because there's a big lip there. It's even holding on the solar panels up. There we go, anyway, don't matter. Anyway, so I think he's done well, so thank you very much to Paul. You know, I think a thank you goes a long way. He's getting paid, but, you know, I think a thank you sometime is better than money. That's in my book anyway. Anyway, I'll catch you later. Thank you. Bye. Reet, let's have a look what I'm doing in the daytime. The daytime job. Uh, oh, that's me mate Graham. Ah, or we call him Bloody Donald actually. You know. We're in Corf Castle of all places. There's a castle over there, look. Beautiful view. So what's happened here, look, the building's actually spread, I reckon about an inch. We put these um, stainless steel heli coil there, threaded bar, resined it in. Run out of resin, so we're going to put these other ones in with a strong water mix. There we go. You know, here he is. Yeah, do you want to explain what is this place? It's, what is it? The it's church? A congregational church. Congregational Corf church, Corfe Castle. Corf Castle. Yeah. Oh, there's a lot of sirens, isn't there? That's rock hard, isn't it? The old um. That's gone rock hard, isn't yeah. it? Rock hard. Hey. Rock hard. Look at that rock. There Look you go. Oh yeah, and somebody's done the a bad job with the guttering. It's all fun. <laughs> I don't know who done it, but it's basically running the wrong way. It's only just been done. Look at it. It's only it's like just a, been done. Yeah. <laughs> You've only just been slate slipping out. You know what? The, you know, <laughs> Fred Dibner would not. There we go. Anyway, let's give you a little 360 or 180. <laughs> there he is. Professional. You yeah. know. All right. Yeah. Catch you. Right. Welcome back. We're just going to show. Graham, he's filling up the old syringe with uh, the old three in one mix, nice and creamy. Nice and creamy. Yeah, I've had this gadget in the back of my shed, honestly, for 10 years. And I've never used it. Look at that. Hey. <laughs> yeah, this will break the video up a bit. I nod. I nod. <laughs> That's it, fill it right up, right up the top. Look at the action of bloody Donald there. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I tell ah. you. Come out, got the old finger over yeah, the end. Yeah, yeah. Well done. Lovely action there, Graham. You know, proper bow, I tell thee. Oh, oh, no. you, pull, oh you got to pull the trigger back. He's getting, see, that's the trouble on your own camera. It makes you a bit makes you a little edgy. Bit. Edgy. 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 Right, welcome back. Sorry about that. The old GoPro ran out of battery, so we syringed that in there. Well, it's a treat, isn't it, Graham? Well, it's a treat. Never used it before, but you've got to mix it up. That is pretty good, actually. Yeah, really creamy, I'd say. Otherwise, it won't come through. So, yeah, Graham's filling all these voids in it. You see that? Go back in. Turn all the way. Now, get back. Filling all the voids in, then we're going to point this up with a lime mortar. Uh, cover it up with a damp sheet. Let me get back. Yeah, look at Graham in action, eh? Graham in action, yeah. Yeah, cover it up with a damp sheet. Hopefully it's not going to rain today. To the stone, yeah. And there we go. So we'll catch you in a bit. Right, little update on the old building project at home. Not as exciting as Corf Castle because it's just a flat roof. So see what Paul's done? 
put the first coat of um, felt on so that's tacked on I don't know much about it yeah and it's cut back into the existing look so hopefully see the old skylight that's good covered up it's not in yet obviously um, yeah hopefully Saturday we're gonna be here putting a torch on felt on and then it's completely waterproof and I think I'll probably take the scaffold down then do the fascias off for like a hop up all right there we go have a little look in the field again you know if you must all right I'll catch you later bye right we're back on the old Corfe castle job the church with my mate Donald all right <laughs> <laughs> all right Donald let's go and have a look what we've done <clears throat> Just had lunch. Got to replace them two copens later. Pointed up with a bit of lime yesterday and then raked it back this morning. My mate, Graham, he's gonna brush it off now. He's done a good colour match there, Graham. Not bad. Honey, Ian. Hey? Oh, Ian. Oh, Ian. So, so Ian was a good, a good judge. Time it goes. There we go. Good. He's hitting it hard. Hitting it hard. Is that stiff brushing? Well, not at the moment. Then. Oh no, will be. Will no, be. He's very thorough. Just to uh... very thorough. You can see on the bottom of he's brushing off. Where you are now. That's it. Yeah, that's right it. That's it, Graham. Let it go off a little bit. Yeah. Actually, there's a little bit of a mist up there. Mm. Up the top of it, that. You get it? I oh, missed that. All oh, right. I mean, not you. <laughs> a little bit there as well. All right. There we go, look. Not bad, is it? A couple of comedians. <laughs> Probably could do with a bit of a spray up oh, now. Oh, yeah, we would. Yeah, you've got to keep it sprayed up. Otherwise, it'll all crap. Yeah, sneaking off there a bit. All right, all right. Right. All right, you got your joke, Graham? No, I haven't got a joke just yet. Oh, what about? All right. <laughs> oh, I got my joke then, all right. Well, what's your there, Roy? Well, the missus shouted at me. Come on, Roy, Roy. <laughs> Put the bins out, can you? I said, stop talking rubbish. <laughs> and that's that's one of mine, I know it's crap, but... And Graham, have you got one yet, Graham? Not yet, no, not yet. Come on. <laughs> we can't, I can't do two takes. Yeah. What do you mean you can't do two takes? Oh, I can. Not not. I'll be back in a minute for Graham's joke. I'll catch you in a bit. <laughs> right. I work so bad, we got to cover it up. <laughs> get it covered up. Go on, get it covered up. There you go. <laughs> Graham's got a joke, but he hasn't... <laughs> He hasn't thought of one yet. Come on, Donald. He's coming, you know, he's coming. Well, you know, Donald. Don't. <laughs> right, Graham, stage name, stage name Donald, has finally got a joke for us. Are you ready? All right, all right let me get you in. You, you settled, settle down, settle down. Settled? Yeah, go on then. Anyway, hairdresser gets a job to cut Prince Charles's hair at Buckingham Palace. Anyway, he drives into the car park. As he's getting out, security come over. And they said, what are you doing? He says, I've come to cut Prince Charles's hair. He says, have you got a permit? He says, no, short back inside. <laughs> Excellent. That's it. Right. Friday night. Well, not Friday, Friday afternoon. <laughs> Friday afternoon. We've got to finish early. Let me just... Can't really see what we've done because it's all covered up. Hold on a minute. We took... What do we do? What have we done, Graham? Oh, yeah, we took the two coping stones off. Rebedded them. Uh, finished pointing the top, that's all covered over. And that's about it anyway, so I'll catch you later. Alright, welcome back. Back on the old um, conservatory project. <laughs> we ain't going to be doing no torch on felt today. Paul's turned up, but he's just doing the old drips look. Let's see him in action. So, what we've done, what we, what we you've explain. Done. So we've cut these at 310 mil for a three inch drip. So I'll get a bit of the card, the stiffener, drip stiffener. Drip stiffener. Put that in. Some people don't do this, so I just do it. So I fold it along the card, like that, to form the three inch drip. Just press it down. Fold it over again. That creates your drip. What was Sykes he say? No, Paul, no, Paul, no, Paul. no, no, it's the wrong way. So that, this is how I was taught 30 years ago. How long? 30. 30? 30, <laughs> when I did, a, when I did <laughs> seven months flat roofing. All right, he's done a bit of earth bent. So then, you've got Apart your drip. Time. 
Oh yeah, drip. Drip, see? So you've got your drip formed, then you can yeah, do your cut. Hold on, so hold on. Just, cut, just punch show this up. little cut while we're here. Yeah, so this is where you're going to lap onto. So you cut down through to your first fold, just underneath. Then at an angle to your second fold, like that. Little bit, little bit, little bit harder. Like that, so that it doesn't bunch up when you're nailing it on. So could you boom, mate? So it nails up, folds over, yeah. and then you got your right. top bit that laps over 150 mil. But we might have to do. You gonna do it Monday? Probably Monday, yeah. Might have to take a day off work. My job, making tea, and well, sweeping up. Well, you cut and sweep. Well, yeah, but you know, mainly sweeping up and making tea. Anyway, that might catch you on Monday. Say goodbye. Bye. Right, welcome back. So, a quick look at the old dogs. Oh, just talking to the YouTubers, Paul. <laughs> right, we finally got a dry day. Hopefully. But the roof is quite wet. Alright, say hello, Paul. Yeah, morning, morning. <laughs> We're back again on the flat roofing. Uh, uh, oh, yeah, hold on. So, what are you actually doing, Paul? Oh, just nailing the, nailing the first tack coat down. We don't use the staplers like, um, well, I won't say who. Steve Sykes? No, 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 no. We pin it down. How many of them nails you got there? Like that? Well, you do diamond formation. I didn't realise you had to put that many. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's alright. Right. I could whack them, you can chuck them. Yeah, that's it. We'll just pin them oh. in like that. Alright, we get them knocked in and we'll try and do a bit of time lapse. We'll come back in three hours' time when we got all these in. <laughs> yeah. Alright, <laughs> see you in a bit. Just started to dry and then the big black clouds coming over and it's just starting to rain. Bloody nightmare, I tell thee. Never mind. So much for the weather app. It's meant to not rain today. There we go. How we do it, we'll have to. Burn the ice down there. Hold on, hold on, let me get a good Pull angle. Pull them on up, nice and tight. That's it. Tap, tap, tap. Oh, keep, swap hands, dissipate oh, the yeah. heat. Hot hands. Get, get, the, get the heat out. Oh. You try yeah. doing it. Nice work, you do. Hand collects the heat. And then, I'm satisfied. Customer? Yeah, that's actually okay. We get our... Oh, you little fillet here. Fillet, fillet. I forgot about that. Yeah, fillet. We get our labour in hands. Dead man, they call him. Dead man, eh? Dead man, dead man. Dead man. Yeah, you don't want to burn it too much, you know, there's no need to. Not with this SBS special stuff. <laughs> oh, SBS? <laughs> yeah. Right, yeah. that's enough Just bit. Always make sure your, your gun's not burning the ice down. Just check very on it. Don't shoot this a fact, you Yeah, because you could. could. going on the upstand of the skylight. <laughs> Fire! Thank you. 
go. Why don't, did oh, you want more? It's gone off, isn't it? Yeah, I'll turn it off, yeah. yeah. That's it, is it? There we go, that's the final. Just got to trim all that up, all that's around the edge. Then we get the skylight up. Tickety boo. Right, it's finally time to move the old skylight. Going to stick it on this little bogey trolley. It's got to be turned round, and then we'll get it round and get it up on the scaffolding. Alright, good, is it just it? That's it. Alright, we're going to move the old skylight now. I'm going to lift this side, and Paul is going to put the bogey under there. Good pressure. Halfway. Right, that's maybe. Yeah, yeah, she's not there. Everybody says they're looking for a shelter We go with the final yeah, we'll lift start. anyway. Yeah, we're still looking we rock hard. We got Sandy on camera. Yeah, he's going to see it. Right, two, three. Two, three, four. All right, so we're going to have a loop. Right, I'll guide it in. I'm all right there. Right. What's the lift on this side? Guide it. Uh, miles out square. Miles out square. Put it in, Mark. Miles out square. What are you like now, Paul? I'm alright, yeah. Yeah, it's going down. It's going down. You can see that stuff's good, eh? You got it in? Is it in? I think so. There we go, alright, that'll do it, Sandy. There we go, all in and finished, so we'll catch you later. Right, welcome back. That was a relief to get the old skylight in. So, thanks to Michael, Mark, and Paul. Um, well, especially to Paul, really, because he's been brilliant, really. You know, he's done all the um, timber work on the flat roof. He's done the felting. He said he's never felt better, actually. Um, yeah, he's done, he's done brilliant. Um, I'm not going to put how much it costs so far, because he hasn't given me a bill yet. He's only just finished that stage of it, so I'm gonna, it's not really worth it, really. Um, yeah, I'll put the, the amount up on the next video, if that's all right. Who else have got to thank? Oh, my comedy um, partner, Graham, because I've mixed this video up a little bit. I've done a bit of the um, conservative project and a bit of the work we've been doing at the church at uh, Corfe Castle, just to mix things up a bit. Um, what else? What else can I think of? Um, yeah, just a relief to get that window in, you know, because something could easily go wrong. It did weigh a lot. I think I've tweaked my back. Ooh, I tell thee. And... You can see I haven't had a shave for a week. Not being lazy, I've just never had no razors. Sandy keeps forgetting to um, buy them. Anyway, I'm going out tonight. We're going for a sort of first pub lunch since lockdown. Um, going to the checkers at Lich Metrois. And it was nice before lockdown, so hopefully it's nice afterwards. Anyway, keep watching. Anyway, thanks for watching this video. Any any YouTubers, thanks for watching. You know, if you'd like to subscribe, feel free. And if you'd like to give me a like or a comment, it's all welcome. Um, I've got a little tune after this, so keep watching. So I've been Roy Leonard. Thanks very much, and I'll catch you in my next video. And goodbye. Thank you. Right, welcome back. I'm going to have a go. I'm going to have a go at Five Years by the late, great David Bowie. Me and my wife went to see him in 2003 at the Isle of Wight Festival. The best concert. Let's see what I can do with this. What, I can, what mess I can make of this.
me mama sighing You should just come over We have five years left to cry in You sky whipped as he told us Earth was really dying Cried so much his face was wet And I knew he was a lying I heard telephones, I'm roused, fill my lungies, the soft boys, toys, electric eyes and TVs, I'm grinning like a warehouse, no room to spare, I had to cram so many things and start them all there, and all the fat, skinny people, all the tall, short people, all the nobody people, all the somebody people. Went off her head with some tiny children. The black hair that dragged her off, you know, I swear she would have killed them. A soldier with a broken arm fixed the stare to the wheels of Cadillac. The cop knelt and kissed the feet of a priest, and the queer flew up at the side of that. I thought I saw you at an ice cream parlor. Milkshakes long cold Smiling, waving, looking so fine I bet you didn't know you were in this song Well it was cold and it rained And I felt like an actor And I thought of Mark And I want to get back there Your face, your race, the way that you are You're beautiful, I kiss you I want you to know we got five years Stuck on our own, we got five years what a surprise! Five years, my brain hurts a lot. Five years, that's all we got. There we go. Five years, David Bowie, done by Roy Leonard. Not very good, I know. So I hope you like this video, and I will catch you in my next video. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.